Hi guys, and in this tutorial I'll be looking at supply and demand curves and what causes them to fluctuate. As shown above, here is a typical supply curve and there are various reasons why a supply curve will shift to the right. If a supply curve shifts to the right, it basically means that you are increasing supply. However, a change to the supply curve to the left basically means that supply is being reduced in the factory or from the producer. So what causes a supply curve to shift to the right? Well the first thing is a decrease in the cost of production. So this could come from lower wages or lower raw material costs. If the cost is low then they can produce more at the same price. Secondly, an increase in the number of producers will ultimately cause the supply curve to shift to the right because if you have more producers therefore this ultimately increases the output of the supply curve. Thirdly, an increase in the supply curve to the right can ultimately be caused by uh, an expansion in capacity of existing firms. So an example of this would be building a new factory. If, if there are more factories therefore the firm or business can create more because there are more factories producing the good. Another reason why supply can increase is due to an increase in supply of a complementary good. As you should already know, a complementary good is basically something that goes well with another good. So, for example, strawberries and cream. So, say if there's an increase in supply of strawberries, this will ultimately lead to an increase in supply of cream because people are wanting to buy the cream with the strawberries. Climatic conditions can also affect supply. So say if you've got a farming industry, if you've got sunny weather, then that can increase your supply of your given food or good that you're trying to grow. To the point, you can increase supply if there are better advancements in technology. Advancements can include things such as better computers or internet connection. And lastly, you can increase supply by reducing taxes or increasing government subsidies to encourage growth. Similar to a supply curve, demand curves also follow similar traits. So if you have a shift to the right in a demand curve, this basically means that demand has increased. And otherwise, if a, a shift to the left in demand curve can also show a lowering in demand or a fall in demand. So what causes a supply curve to, to shift to the right? Well, the first reason is an increase in disposable income. So if, if people have more money, they'll probably be more likely to buy the good because they've got more disposable income to set aside to buy it. Moreover, the quality of the good, if it increases, that can also increase demand. So for example, if there's a new iPhone out and it has lots of new features, then that might increase demand for it because people want it more than what they used to want it. Obviously, increased advertising can also increase your demand for a product. So for example, let's go back to the iPhone. If they increase lots of advertising for the iPhone, more people are going to see it and then it will lead to an increase in demand. More to the point, an increase in the price of substitutes can also increase demand. So for example, if the price of O2 mobile phone calls increases, the demand for Vodafone mobiles will increase because people will sway away from O2 and then go to Vodafone. If this video has helped you, then please feel free to subscribe to my YouTube channel and please, please, please like this video. If you have any questions, feel free to comment below. And just for the record, this video is aimed at AQA A-level economics, but it may be applicable to your exam board if you're studying it at A-level.